Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome if you are new here. My name is Shan, if you don't know me, from Home with Shan over on Instagram. Head on over and follow me if you don't already. But today's video is going to be all about my maternity capsule wardrobe. So this has been such a highly requested video and I really wanted to film it. I just wanted to get it right and I wanted to make sure that all of the bits weren't in the wash and that it was all here ready for you so I can show you exactly how I like to style about 14 items that can literally create unlimited looks. All of these items are going to be spring summer related but you can definitely transition these into like autumnal kind of outfits and also spring as well maybe not with for winter but you could maybe just add some tights or something like that if you were looking to add these for winter clothing these are all of my essential items that i think you should have in your maternity wardrobe to literally last you be comfortable and actually wear them after being pregnant as well because most of these items aren't even maternity items some of them are and some of them aren't so i will go through everything with you at first and then i'll do a try on at the end of the video just to show you how i like to style everything so i'll go through the items now and so i've got 14 items like i said and then i've got three pairs of shoes as well which are like staple shoes i think to be honest they're just my staple shoes in normal life not even in pregnancy um, and i also just wanted to talk about underwear as well i always feel like that's something that's missed out in these videos how important is comfortable underwear that you don't have to see like all the bulky straps and everything underneath your clothes so yeah let's talk about shoes first then underwear and then we can get into the clothes and i can show you how i style everything as, as well okay so the first of the three sets of shoes that i want to show you to be super comfortable during your pregnancy and looking good in maternity and all that kind of stuff Let's face it, we don't want to wear high heels or fancy sandals or having to lean down and buckle up your shoes and all that kind of stuff. The most essential pair of shoes in summer ever are Birkenstocks, in my opinion. Okay, these aren't actually Birkenstocks. These are actually from Boohoo. You can see they're exactly the same as normal pair of Birkenstocks. And um, I absolutely love them. I've got the one strap ones. It's so easy to just slip on your foot and you don't have to lean down buckle anything up and obviously when you are pregnant and have the bump it's hard to lean down anyway so these are the most essential pair of shoes for me 100 percent next up for shoes we obviously have converse mine are so grotty and old but i love them so much i literally just wear these throughout all the spring all the summer i absolutely love converse and then lastly on shoes i have these sort of dressy more dressy not really that dressy sandals here they obviously have a slight heel as you can see these ones are just from um i think dorothy perkins like a year ago maybe two years ago um but loads of places have these kind of things they're just such a simple sandal they dress up a look because they've got the slight wedge um but i absolutely love them and i will show you how i style all of these shoes in the next couple of clips okay let's quickly talk about underwear and i never thought i'd be showing my underwear on youtube but it is essential guys because I feel like no one talks about how to be pregnant and wear underwear that you can't see through all of your clothes but be comfortable at the same time so i just wanted to talk about these first of all these are the um sports bras from primark so they haven't got a um strap or anything at the back but they are so comfortable i kid you not they've got removable um padding inside but i like the padding to be honest um just so you can't see the nips i absolutely love them i've got these in so i've got a white one on at the moment because i've got a white um vest top on i've got the gray and i've got the black and they come in a set of three like that and that is 10 pounds and i've got them in a size medium because boobs are growing guys so yeah to make sure that i'm really comfortable i have them in a size medium and they are the best thing i've ever bought honestly even if i wasn't pregnant these would be definitely in my basket 100 percent the next thing is pants normally if i wasn't pregnant i would probably wear thongs but because i don't really like the vpl and all that kind of stuff and i like to just know that that's not on show however in pregnancy that is not an option so i am wearing currently these these are the no vpl high rise um knickers from MS and they come in a pack of five and they are 12 pounds so i just find that MS are the best for underwear i absolutely love these for comfort and they don't show through leggings or jeans or anything like that so there's no vpl whatsoever and i just love them they're so comfortable and they don't make you feel like you are an absolute granny if you do prefer a little bit more coverage then i would suggest maybe going for the midi um but i have pretty much stayed true to size in these i've got like a size 10 um but yeah i absolutely love the high-rise knickers from ms <laughs> 
Okay, so now let's get into the clothes. So the first thing that I wanted to talk about essential wise was a vest top like this. I know you can get the maternity ones um, specifically. This isn't a maternity one. This is just one from Primark. Obviously the Primark ones are quite long, so they go over a pregnant belly very, very well. I absolutely love mine. I think they do them in literally every single color under the sun. They are so, so cheap. It's honestly the best investment. You should have them in your wardrobe anyway. And then I've also got my my maternity leggings on so these maternity leggings are from H&M they go all the way over the belly I absolutely love them they are so comfortable I've tried so many maternity leggings and these are the best ones by far they're a slight bit see-through but actually it doesn't matter like to me at all so if you're the same then I really wouldn't worry about it I absolutely love these ones they go right over and I've been wearing these since about 15 weeks and I've grown into them and I feel like I've definitely got more space to grow as well. I got these true to size so I got them in a size 10 and they are absolutely perfect. The next thing that I want to recommend to you guys is a throw over or a kimono type thing. So this one is from Lily and Ribbon who kindly actually sent me this. I absolutely love it so so much. It is so long and flowy and it's just perfect. This one does button up. I like this that it buttons up because you can wear it in so many different ways. You could have it wear, worn as an actual shirt like that, which I think is really lovely. But I have it open sometimes and sometimes I have it sort of done up like this as well. But yeah, I'll show you in the styling clips at the end how I like to do that. The next thing that I wanted to show you guys is obviously some maternity jeans. Guys, I wasn't even going to bother with maternity jeans, but I'm so glad that Lillian Ribbon sent me these because they are the best fitting jeans ever. Like, period. They are so comfortable. I posted about them on my Instagram and you guys absolutely love them as well, just as much as I did. They are so lovely. They're like, sort of like a mum fit jean, but... I absolutely love how comfortable they were. I thought they'd be so ugly and so misshapen and not look right on the bump and be so uncomfortable, but that is just so far from the truth. They are so nice. And I kid you not, guys, it is so hard to find really good maternity jeans. So if you're going to buy any maternity jeans, definitely check these ones out. They are definitely worth the money, 100% worth the money. And they just look really nice and they change an outfit from being just with leggings to with jeans and honestly you look so much more dressy again i will show you in the clips coming up next thing that i'm going to recommend you get is a tiered top just like this one so this is from next i've got this in the sale but i've actually seen it in tesco as well for eight pounds i think um this is just a tiered top i don't know if you can see it on the camera it's just got these tiers here i absolutely love these and you'll see exactly why i love these so so much for pregnancy but actually this isn't maternity at all so you definitely get away with styling this um, when you're not pregnant. And I think I definitely will wear this after my pregnancy, 100%. The next three items I think you'll probably have in your wardrobe already. One is a crop top. This one is from Zara. You can see that it's like a tight crop top detail here. If you don't have one that has the tie, it can just be a normal crop top. I absolutely love this one because one, the colour is so gorgeous. Plus it has the tie detail so you can cinch it in above your bump and you can really, really shape your bump that way. I love this one so much. I'll link it down below for you guys because it's so good. Next one, this is just, this is actually a slight crop top, but it's more of a boxy fit. And again, I will be tying that up over the top of looks and you'll see how it looks. It looks so nice. This one's a bardo one. Um, again, you don't have to have it like a bardo, but I really like to style it that way. This one is from H&M, but last season, I think. And then something that's really on trend at the moment is just a graphic tee. You can't really see the graphic on this because it's so old. It's actually a Jack Wheels t-shirt again i will just tie that up but something that you could do is like with old band tees or something like that you could do exactly the same thing i'm really lucky that ash has loads of band tees that i could just nick and do the exact same thing tie over my dress or my top whatever i'm wearing and it will just look really nice so yeah they're the three things that I think you'll probably already have in your wardrobe and look really, really cute styling when you're pregnant. Next up, something you're all gonna have is a cardi. So actually this would be better if it was a longer cardi, I think, but this one is just a cream cardi from Tesco. I absolutely love it. It's really, really nice color. And yeah, I think this is just an essential in every single wardrobe, pregnant or not pregnant. It is definitely an essential. And I've just got a tan um, sort of fake suede jacket. Um, this one's like a cropped one. I absolutely love this so, so much. It's from Boohoo, again, ages and ages and ages ago. But I just love it so much. I get it out every single year. But it just changes up a really 
simple outfit to put this on top it makes it look so much nicer then i've just got this blouse this isn't maternity either um it's just an oversized blouse that i would wear with either jeans or leggings again and exactly the same way as i would if i was pregnant i just think it's really really nice i've worn this a few times and lots of people have asked me where it's from it's from new look again ages ago though guys so but any sort of oversized top with like a bit of embroidery or something like that would be so nice and just moving on to dresses so i've got just a normal midi bodycon t-shirt dress this is from primark years ago it's just a t-shirt dress um you can get them pretty much everywhere you can get them on amazon and this is just such a simple staple that you need in your wardrobe anyway this is not maternity like i said but it does show the bump off really, really nicely because it's so fitted i absolutely love this then i've got slightly longer maxi dress this one's got a lovely like floral detail on it this one is from boohoo it is maternity but i definitely wouldn't say it's like really maternity at all like i would definitely wear this afterwards i got this in a size 8 but i should have probably got a size 10 um but i absolutely love it it's really, really nice i can't wear a bra underneath it because like i said i probably should have sized up but i really love it so much it's so comfortable guys maxi dresses generally in pregnancy are so flattering because it hugs your bump so nicely it just shows it off and i just absolutely love it then last but not least i have this sort of white airy dress i oh i'm obsessed with it guys I love it so so much i got it from h&m recently and it's just this airy sort of flowy oh i just love it so much and when it's hot and you're pregnant and you're sweating in the summer it's the nicest flowy dress you'll ever ever wear i love to wear this with tops over the top but also on its own it is just the best dress I've ever bought, honestly. Okay, so now I've run through everything that I've got. My 14 items that I think are essential for your maternity capsule wardrobe. I will now show you how I like to style the items. Literally, you can have unlimited looks with these items because you can switch and change between everything and it looks like a completely different outfit every single time without spending loads of money so yeah i will show you those now and then i'll finish the video there hope you enjoyed it guys let me know what your favorite outfit is from the little try on okay mm -hmm.